Thanks for having my back out there. I was annoyed. Honestly, I think the whole WWE universe was. So, I guess this means we're finally gonna get our match, huh? You're pretty excited for someone who's about to get handled. <laughs> I see how it is. Well, you just go ahead and underestimate me, champ. Oh, I don't underestimate you at all. I've seen your stuff on the indies. I know you can go, but so can I. You've watched my indie matches? I didn't know you'd be into that. What? Just because I started wrestling at WWE and never had an independent run doesn't mean I can't appreciate what you did there. I mean, that dive off the balcony against La Congrejita Loca? Wild. Self-destructive and probably ill-advised, but wild. Man, if you had ever been a free agent when I was in TBD, I would have gladly jumped off a balcony against you too. That sounds like a blast, except I'm the one who would have been doing the jumping. Don't get me wrong, I'm happy with how I came up, but I do sometimes wonder what an indie career would have been like for me. It sounds like an adventure. Huh. What? Just gets me thinking about our match. About whether I'm going to pin or submit you? No, well, not exactly. Someone recently pointed out that I was lucky enough to experience a fantastical whirlwind tour when I got to WWE. I got to have the adventure. I'm wondering if I should pay it forward. What do you have in mind? You're confident you're gonna beat me anyway, right? Anytime, any place. I was really hoping you'd say that. You want to do what? It's just gonna be two matches. Best of three series. So yeah, <laughs> it might go to, if Bianca really has no fight in her. It'll probably go two. That's as many as I need. It's not the best of three series that gives me pause. It's the locales. It is the usual custom to defend the WWE Women's World Championship on WWE TV. Sure, we could do that if we want to stick with what's comfortable or get this. We fight for the Women's World Championship in the coolest indie arenas around. Japan, Mexico, we could even go back to your old stomping grounds in the UK. Honestly, sounds like a great way to push that grassroots international exposure you business types are always talking about. And you know what else it sounds like? Oh, I'm positive you'll tell me. It sounds like a big swing. It sounds like taking advantage of every opportunity on the table. And it sounds like doing something different without being afraid to fail. I know what you're getting at, and I'm not sure I like you turning my words back on me. I'm sorry to interject, but this is ridiculous. It's, it's unheard of. Allowing a WWE champion to defend at these underground indie shows? Untelevised? What about... What about the advertisers? Advertisers? Really? I'm afraid Troy makes an excellent point. Marketing will hate this. See? Fortunately, this is not a marketing company. This is a professional wrestling company. A professional wrestling company that's going to take a swing and whose general manager cannot wait to get on the road. Ugh. The only question is, where to first? Don't look at me. This is your world. I'm just the adventuring tourist who gets to hit you, wherever you so choose. I loved wrestling in Mexico, especially for this promotion called Lucha Magica. Sometimes they do shows in the middle of a town square. You're gonna love it. Except for when I beat you, that part will suck but the rest will be awesome. This is gonna be so tough on your ego. Mexico sound good to you? Alert the crew to get their passports, Troy. We're taking it international. Scheduled for one fall, making her way to the ring 
from Jersey City, New Jersey, AJ Lee! Dear, 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 
That cannot have gone as you'd hoped. No. Everything went exactly according to my plan of getting hit in the face a bunch. Are you regretting giving Bianca the invitation into the Indies? Not at all. I missed the intimacy of a smaller show, the interaction with the fans. Just didn't expect Bianca to pull the same energy from the crowd quite as easily as she did. Bianca got very comfortable very quickly. If she had come up in the Indies, I would have wanted her for TBD. But that's not going to stop me from beating her at our next stop. <laughs>